What's going on, guys? This is the Wild Effect, and I believe I said last video was going to be my last video that I would do prior to Crown Tundra. However, I decided to. There were some recent developments uh, in the hacking scene to do with pure hackmons um, that could potentially be very relevant to other stuff as well. Um, there was a fellow named the Nathaninator. I don't know what his actual username is. That was what his YouTube channel was that had this YouTube video on there. Uh, he posted that if you have an Eternaeus Eternamax with exactly 656 defense um, or other stat, I believe it was 656 defense. Actually, now that I think about it, how did he get that that high? Um, but... Um, he had it with 656 defense, and this made it very, very, uh, it overflowed the number, actually, uh, to a very low number. Oh, because defense stats are really high. Okay, so his defense stats are the ones that are really high. I thought it was its attack stats that were the ones that were really high. I think it's just, like, Omega bulky. Anyway, so, a turn Eternatus, um, Eternamax has 250 base defense and special defense, which no other Pokemon is even close to hitting. So anyway, what we're going to do um, is we're going to compare a little bit here and see what the heck's going on. So I've got here several Pokemon. Um, so according to his video, if you hit a defense stat of 600 or 65,000, or excuse me, of 655, or 655, uh, then this should be displayed as zero. Now that I think about it, now that I doubly think about it. I did 655 and 656, so this is going to be interesting. Anyway, so I, I've got a few things to, to test this with, and then we'll see if we can duplicate his uh, Eternatus tests, but I don't really know for sure. So these Sinistee have both have stats that are hacked directly, like super hardcore hacked directly. Um, so if these stats are hacked appropriately, then this Sinistee will have... Uh, very, very, very um, low defense. This will have zero defense, and this will have one defense. So this will make this one really, really bulky, and this one not bulky at all. So I'll go ahead and Aqua Jet each other and see how they behave. This is me, again, just hacking it in directly. This is this is me, like, literally, um, like, ticking the hacked checkbox in PKX and uh, hacking the stats on like this. So they don't correspond to their actual... To what would actually occur in a um, like if they were calculated normally? So I'll just aqua jet myself. Both of these actually. Let's look at the summary screen first and see what this behaves like. So that claims to have 126 defense each. Oh, they might have reset already. They might have reset before I even got into a battle. I don't know if that's if these are real or not. I guess we'll find out. We're gonna keep listening to this one because I'm really addicted to this particular melody. Yeah, that doesn't look like zero or one to me. So it looks like it recalculates it on battle entry. That's that makes it very hard to test. It also makes it irrelevant, which is important to note. So I bet if I like if I killed these guys, well, obviously I would reset everything. But let's go ahead and swap back to our double Celix. It looks like so. It looks like hacking the stat indirectly does not help us at all. Looks like you can't do anything with that. So these two Steelix, uh, one of these Steelix should have effectively 655 defense, and another should have 656 defense. I'm going to go ahead and double full restore, because I could well imagine that this would uh, kill both of them. Okay. These are level 132 and 133, if you did not notice from before. Don't attract me. Uh, okay. Alright, well, we'll go ahead and Aqua Jet ourselves. So again, one of these should have one defense and one of them should have um, zero if it is behaving like that. Okay, good. That doesn't look like a zero or a one. That did uh, 
yeah, these these are both pretty average ranges that I would have anticipated from like a normal thing there. So if I look at their summary screens, you can see their their stats are also like treated weird, so that could have something to do with it potentially, but let's go ahead and uh, reset because I don't think we learned anything from hacking them in this way. So you can't just like directly hack this in. So it looks like it has to be an Eternatus. Because uh, I don't think... You can't give a Pokemon more than 256 EVs or more than 31 IVs. So there's no other way outside of making it an Eternatus. So I'm going to need to live hacks this then. So let me go ahead and connect to the internet. We're going to switch our uh, Bravely Default music as well. Um, so let me go ahead and do this. We'll go ahead and turn on Live Hacks. I used the wrong IP address. Let's see here. Ah, it's 7-3. There we go. Yeah, it didn't work. Okay. Okay, 7-3. Okay, there we go. Okay. Now we have access to be able to live edit our boxes. I'll prove that real quick. So right now I have Steelix here, and I'm going to go ahead and just duplicate the Steelix real quick, just so I can prove it. There we go, look, now I have another Steelix. And now he's gone. Okay, so we need to gen in a Eternatus Eternamax. I believe the easiest way to do that is to take a real Eternatus. So let me go ahead and find one of those. guy over here. Go ahead and take this one. Come back over here. Let's swap to this. Okay. And now uh, we should have an Eternamax. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. Uh, <laughs> big. <laughs> yeah. Hey, he shows up his regular Eternatus in here, but uh, let's go ahead and grab a couple of these guys. So the only way to hit it with this guy is if I make this guy like, um, I'll go ahead and make him calm. Um... I need to take off some other stuff. Alright. Okay. So let's see here. 655. We need to hit this number then. 655 is what? Uh, let me do a swap this. Nope, that's too low. Alright, there's 264. Uh, okay, that took away that, so. This looks so stupid. Okay. Alright, that one has uh, 654. I'll go ahead and grab one with uh, 655 as well. Alright, 655. Alright. And they both have Dynamax cannon, so that should be good enough for me. I have no idea what happens if you lead double Eternamax, or in doubles as well, by the way. I, 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 I do not know what this, if this actually crashes the game or something. I hope it does. That'd be funny as heck if it did. 
All right, Dwight, what do you got against this? Well, I didn't crash immediately. That's good to know. And you see, um, because Eternamax has uh, stats that are naturally this high, it works pretty well. Aha, and you can see here, you can already see here. You see that how that one has zero? That's what this fell discovered. For some reason, it looped around to zero. And we don't know why. It just happens to be 655. So if I uh, attack each other, one of these should do significantly more damage than the other. Oh, what's he doing? Okay, that one did two damage. And you can see that one did a lot more. So the one that only took two damage is because he only has zero defense right now. And so he took two damage because... Uh, probably he probably rolled a random damage roll of one. Oh, look, you can see. You can see him. Let's see if it crashes if it loads both of them at the same time. I'm trying to see if we can... If we can get a double uh, Eternamax on the screen, that'd be kind of cool. I'm going to go ahead and just let it run. It looks like it's only going to show case one of them at a time, though. Hmm. Anyway. This, this is, uh... Oh, there we go. There we go. That looks sick. It's like a double, double hand. And then we got Swirlix. <laughs> oh, wait, no, it's Milsuri. I'm an idiot. Yep, there we go. I wish I could uh, turn a beam myself. That's going to be cool. Let's just go ahead and kill these guys, just for fun. Blarg. Oh, this is with animations off. So it's not as exciting. Bleh. Larry's online. All right, Larry, you want to square up against my Eternamax? Yeah, the nice thing about Eternamax is that it um, persists uh, throughout battles like this. Um, so, like, yeah, whatever, I don't care. Thanks, Dwight. Okay. Yeah, you can see here, these guys, they're happy to stick around afterwards. I don't think they persist through saves, but... So this guy is this, and if I just... Um, so if I make this guy any higher... So, like, if I hack in another one real fast... With, uh, say, max spadef. So you can see it says 658 there. But this one doesn't. Interesting. What the heck? Scope with that then. Why does this one say 658? That one doesn't loop around. What happens if I gen in with 656 then? That doesn't make any sense to me. Okay. So we got 656 now and 657. Pardon the giant blobs here. See, that one says 656, that one says 657. So, that one says zero, but that one... It's it's only the 655 number. Let's just hop all these guys in here. I can battle another uh, guy, and that should be fine. So, let's go ahead and grab 658. Uh, let's actually, let's grab 656. And we'll pair him with 657 Eternatus. Shouldn't miss that one. Let's go with this one. Let's fly up to the city because it's got him. Um, uh, which side is he on? I think he's on this side. So, with Hammer Lock. I have not battled. Uh, I don't know who this guy is. 
this cafe guy. The other one's Dwight. And the only reason I know that guy is Dwight is because someone posted a hilarious comment in one of my videos about how like I keep beating up on Dwight. Now, who are you? All right, who are you? Bernard. All right, Bernard. I'm Leonard right here. Let's see what you can do versus my double Eternatuses. All right, Dynamax Ken and myself. Well, that one just died. So. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that one died. That one died too! <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, uh. So those those guys are definitely being treated as if they have very, very low spadef. Even though they don't say it. Oh, now they say it. Must be once they enter a battle. It, like, updates it or something. All right. Well, uh, that's all I need to prove. So I think that should be sufficient uh, for what we wanted to do. Um, hopefully, um, PK Hacks update soon after Crown Chandra so we can see all this kind of stuff again. But this is really cool. All right, until next time, have a good one.